Amazing entries uh, so far from you guys for the uh, competition. Absolutely brilliant. So um, good luck to you all. And the winner will be picked on Tuesday evening. Um, and obviously tomorrow, Monday evening, we'll, we will be in the Shed of Wonder for the Frosty Cycling Crew Strava review. So I'm looking forward to that. Obviously with Rider of the Week and then we've got the uh, announced the winner of the um, climbing competition. So if you've climbed over 1,000 feet this week, um, you will be entered in the draw to win a brand new Rafa cap. So all good guys, all good. I've had my porridge this morning as you saw. I've had my tea, I hope I've got everything. I always have that horrible feeling that I've forgotten something. When you're packing your bike and you're buying stuff away, there's always so much stuff that you need to uh, you need to pack. Yes, Duncan, good morning mate by the way. I've ordered that um, wiggle uh, wheel cover that uh, you kind of used to gave me the link for a couple of vlogs ago. What was it last week? Might have been last week. Um, so I've ordered that today, so I should be getting it in the next couple of days. But um, absolute bargain, fourteen ninety nine for a um, wheel cover. So rather than just leave my front wheel floating around in the back under the bike, I can have it in a, in a protective cover and sit it in the front footwell, which is so much. Good morning to Mr. Doily Burger. Grant, I hope you're well, mate. And Dylan yesterday, riding your, uh, doing your Half spin, Turn right on charity the spin one. Um, workout thing for the um, Bow Bath um, Fireman's Charity. I think that's correct, isn't it? But um, massive kudos to you guys for doing that as well. Superb stuff. And uh, Grant, thank you for your advice re those wheels um, a couple of days ago, so I'm not going to go for those pro ride wheels anymore. I know last year I was speaking about getting wheels, new wheels for the bike, and I just never got around to doing it. Um, but uh, Grant sent me a message. <coughs> 
Grant sent me a message about um, Turn right on a wheel set that he highly recommends. So I've had a look at that, and it's, so it's either between those, I can't remember what they're called. Um, was it Sevo? Not sure. Anyway, I'm rambling. Um, so it's either those or the Fulcrum Racing Freeze. After the roundabout, take the second exit on the to get. Um, because they are on offer on Wiggle at the moment, the Racing Threes. At a really good price, so... Yeah, we shall see, hopefully in the next few weeks I can get some new wheels. You said you better get to know me Just approaching Richmond Park, guys. I had a great ride here. Been really quick. Tony, Tony's there. Absolutely great superb. Views, great views down over the Thames there. Oh, mate, brilliant. Yeah. And as you just said, we're heading into the sunshine. Thanks to you pushing on so much, we got here really quick. <laughs> Yes, guys, we're in the park. Bloody love this place. It's uh, just gone 10 o'clock, Sunday morning. We've just done 14 miles, so. All good. Got Tony, Stevie and Ian in front. There's some blue sky and a bit of sunshine. <laughs> so there's Tony just behind, we're just doing our first loop of Richmond Park. Ian and Stevie are ahead somewhere. You alright Tony? I'm doing alright Mark, I know you're in the front, ripping me legs off. He's joking, I'm not ripping anyone's legs off. <laughs> no, trust me, he really is. <laughs> Just going at a nice pace. It's all good. Tony's here just next to me, riding his winter bike. The Quest. Look at that, guys, it looks absolutely beautiful. That is in beautiful condition, mate. It's, um, I'll just keep it clean. It's lovely. But it's very heavy, so it makes me very slow, and that's my excuse for the day. Me and Tony have gone for the uh, team jackets today. Castelli Perfetto. <laughs> Unfortunately, we're not sponsored by them, so we have to buy them. <laughs> yeah. No freebies here. So I think this is our second loop. Is this our second loop, Tony? It's, yeah, second loop. So we're coming up to the third one. And Ian and Stevie are way ahead somewhere. Oh, they're smashing it. They're way out in front. Yeah. We're just plodding around at a nice, easy pace, which is awesome. Yeah. 
someone gave me a 105 group set, or a fair bit of it, mm. and I bought yeah, 105 so when we do the Frosty Cycling Crew Strava group ride on 25th of March, this cafe and car park will be the meeting place, so it's the Caliche Cafe. And there's loads of car parking spaces. There's the cafe there. They also do bike hire as well. But there's loads of parking places. Those who are taking the bus. Oh, oh yeah, nice. Yeah, so guys, 25th of March. This will be the meeting place at nine o'clock for the FCC group ride. So we're just doing a couple of uh, anti-clockwise loops now. Tony's just in front and then Ian and Stevie are just a little bit further ahead. So it's absolutely cracking, it's like a cycling mecca in Richmond Park. So I think each loop is about 6.3 miles. So this is our third loop I think, third or fourth, I've lost count. Right, so we're just heading for the exit now. The Richmond Park Gate exit. Something like that. Anyway, yeah, we're heading for the exit. We've done four loops. It's 12.30. Done 44 miles so far, so it's all good. It's really started to cloud over. So we're heading back to Stevie's. We may have a cafe stop on the way back. But it's been absolutely brilliant. Riding with Tony, Ian and Stevie around uh, Richmond Park. Quality stuff. Right, so we said goodbye to Tony and Ian a few miles back and uh, me and Stevie have just added on an extra loop so we've done the 100k for today which is fantastic because I didn't envisage doing 100k today so it's been absolutely brilliant so a massive thank you to Stevie, Ian and Tony awesome riding with you legends again absolutely love it guys just leaving turn Stevie's left onto Woodstock Drive and turn left onto Swakley's Road what an absolutely cracking ride that was. Brilliant. And we. Uh, left onto Swakely's Road. Oh, please. He's interrupting me. And we squeezed in 100k, which was absolutely fantastic. And um, just awesome riding with Tony and Ian, Stevie. Sorry, I just had to pull it out a bit quick there in onto the road. Yards, use the um, roundabout but yeah. Um, absolutely cracking ride, loved it. The time is now 2.30 exactly. Use the roundabout to make a use. So I'm just heading home now. I think we got the best of the weather this morning as well because it was lovely and in sunny when we were in uh, Richmond Park. Take the first exit onto Morville Road. And then just as we kind of decided to leave, it started to get a lot chillier and um, cloud 
over a lot, but we were really flying on the way home. It was fantastic. The four of us in a chain gang. Oh my days, guys, we were we were bombing along. It was so good. Absolutely loved it. Anyway, guys, I hope you're all good. I hope you've all had a lovely weekend, whatever you've been up to. And um, if you've been out, I hope you've had a cracking ride. And if you've been indoors, I hope you've had a good one on the Swiss. See you on um, Monday evening in the Shed of Wonder for the FCC Strava Group Review. And then uh, don't forget as well, I'll be uh, announcing the winner tomorrow of the FCC weekly challenge which was, I can't remember if I mentioned earlier, if I mentioned it earlier or not, which was the uh, climbing 1,000 feet or more during the week. You will be entered in the draw to win a Rafa cap, so we in should do that line, tomorrow night as well. About, take the first exit onto Mortal Road. So guys, enjoy the rest of your Sunday. Hopefully I'll have this vlog up for you by Monday morning. I've got to leave early tomorrow though, work, I'm, I'm heading down to Bournemouth. So I've got an early start tomorrow. But um, look after yourselves, guys. Stay safe out there. And I'll see you in the Shed of Wonder. Bye for now, you legends.